So it's kind of exciting. Um, a big production company here in Los Angeles decided that they wanted to make a movie about being a Beverly Hills plastic surgeon. And as part of the deal, the studio is sending their lead actor over to shadow me so he can kind of really understand what it's all about. Uh, they sent pictures of him over, his bio and everything. And I gotta tell you, you know, normally I feel like Hollywood casts people that are a lot better looking than the actual actor, but in this, kind of, in this case, I feel like they're kind of about the same. It's all subjective. Welcome to Glanis Plastic Surgery. How may I help you? I'm here to see Dr. Uh, um... Dr. Glanis? You know what? I'm going to take that from the top and do it again. <clears throat> I'm here to see Dr. Galanis. You can tell him I'm here. Okay. Dr. Galanis, we have a very strange man here in the waiting room. No, I, I, I don't know what's going on. Corey, Dr. Galanis, sorry to keep you waiting. I just finished up with a consult back there and we we're just gonna- If I'm gonna do your story justice and I will, I need to know not only what you do, but who you are. I need to feel the pain that you felt when your parents beat you as a child. I want to know the heartbreak when she left, man, and made, made you move to Beverly Hills and open up a private okay. practice. Okay, my, my parents never beat or did whatever. That, that, that didn't happen. So. Therefore, from here on out, I shall answer to no one else other than Dr. Galanis. Wait, do you mean that you want me to call you Dr. Galanis or you mean you're only gonna answer to me what? Dr. Galanis, exactly. thank you so much. I feel so comfortable now. It was now. great to meet you. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you, okay. thank you. Okay, we'll, we'll talk to you soon. Thank you very thank much. Thank you for coming. Uh, Beautiful creature. Okay, let's, Amazing. let's go into my office and get started, okay? Lots to do. You know, De Niro drove a taxi for Taxi Driver. Nicholson learned how to do shock therapy for Cuckoo's Nest. Spice Girls learned how to sing for their 1997 film debut, Spice World. Corey Grant will become a board-certified plastic surgeon before we start shooting. You know why? Because that's what the greats do. They commit. I've seen Dr. Glonis' Instagram. Quite frankly, I can do it better. <laughs> I already am. Rhinoplasty, rhinoplasty, 50 cc stat augmentation. Ah, <laughs> the best actor in the world, Corey, you got this. I mean, Dr. Galanis, you're Dr. Galanis. Dr. Charles Galanis. Well, not only is he better looking than me, but uh, he's kind of, um, well, he's an idiot. <laughs> I think I made a huge mistake. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be great, right? Rhinoplasty. <sighs> hey there, how are you? Next time on the Galanises. It's important for Corey to understand a central philosophy of my practice. I'd like to go bigger, is that right, Shelley? Our job is to listen, get to know them a little bit, uh -huh. understand what their goals are, and just educate them on what the options are. Oh, yeah, so that's where I know him from. He was the bartender on All My Children. Do, uh, do guys ever get uh, implants anywhere on their body? Has that ever, have you heard of that? I really try to maintain my office in that way just so people can have that. Corey!